Hello, my most awesome project managers. Welcome to our final episode in the knowledge areas for this study of the 40 days to PMP exam success curriculum. Today in stakeholder management, we'll talk about what exactly stakeholder management is. And stakeholders are individuals or entities who are affected by the project or who could affect the project. Watch this. There are also those who think that they could be affected by the project. So the project manager has quite a bit of work to do here. The very first thing is identify stakeholders. So you want to identify those individuals and entities that could be affected by the project, analyze these stakeholders, and document all necessary information. Second thing that you're going to do here is plan stakeholder engagement. So you have your stakeholder register coming into this process. You're going to flesh out the understanding of the stakeholders and then you're going to plan how to keep stakeholders engaged by using a stakeholder engagement assessment matrix or some other model. The bottom line is you'll come out with a stakeholder engagement plan and that's step two. Step three is where you manage stakeholder engagement. This is where you are communicating with stakeholders and working with them in order to keep them engaged and focused on the project as appropriate. So to really engage stakeholders, you may conduct certain meetings, you may have symposiums, you might have some water cooler conversations. It really depends on the project. But the bottom line is do what you need to do to keep the stakeholder engaged. Use communications, use visual aids, whatever you need to do, get that stakeholder engaged. Final thing here is to be proactive and ensure that stakeholders are being engaged as needed. Carry out formal and informal surveys to track stakeholder satisfaction and engagement. So it's one thing for stakeholders to show up for meetings. It's another thing for them to be engaged. And it's another thing for them to believe that the team is doing a great job. You need to get all this data from them, all of this information from them. And then you need to take action as needed. If the stakeholder isn't engaged, then what are you going to do to engage them? you got to decide that as a PM. So a lot of work to be done here. I've heard from so many students how big stakeholder was on the exam. So you got to get yourself ready to face stakeholder management. All right. I hope you've enjoyed this knowledge area series. If you've got any questions, if there was anything I didn't answer within the 10 days or the 10 episodes you watched, about just the stakeholder all the way to integration uh, portion, uh, do let me know. Put a comment below because there are 10 episodes. Started off with integration, then scope, schedule, cost, quality, resources, communications, risk, procurement, and now stakeholder. So just let me know if you've got any questions. I'll be more than happy to answer. And also don't forget to hit like and subscribe so you'll be notified when there are more videos. And don't forget, share with your friends. All right, for those of you who are able to watch this in time before the 24th of October, I want you to be aware that day 40 of the 40 days to PMP exam success is going to be live on YouTube. It's also going to be live on Zoom. So if you want to be part of the Zoom and come in and ask questions and be present, you need to look for that link that we've posted on the community board in the Prazion channel. All right. Thank you very much, my friends. Talk to you soon. Bye for now.